So if you've been watching this channel for any length of time, you know that I'm a big fan of the Zebra Sarasa Grand. Uh, this is a very cool pen. It's a, an executive class retractable pen from the Sarasa line, which is, uh, I think, a really excellent line of gel pens. It has this slightly too large springy clip, but past that, the body and click mechanism are all uh, quite nice. It's, uh, I think, a very good looking pen. And they originally sold for about $16, and now they're priced under $10, so I would consider it to be an excellent deal. And then it uses the Zebra Sarasa ink, which is uh, some of the top notch gel ink out there, especially if you are a left-handed individual and you prefer something quick drying. Comes in a bunch of colors. I like it in the black. Uh, but now I recently just picked this up and this is called the Sarasa Grand Royal Silver Limited Edition. I just happened to see this online for sale. I picked it up, Let's see what they have to say about it. Uh, not too much, 0.5 millimeter, uh, very else, very little else said. Uh, so this is the Sarasa Grand, also obviously from Zebra. It is very similar in design to the standard one, but it is a limited edition. So what it is, it could be hard to tell from video, but this is all chromed out. So it's uh, all silver, all metal, all silver. The only part of it that is not silver is this blue here, which is the same on the standard Sarasa Grand that uh, inset pieces, plastic. And then both of them have a, a bit of plastic at the top. So it's interesting that the pens look to be pretty much exactly the same. Obviously this one being all silver is extremely cool looking. Um, I was kind of floored when I saw this. I was very happy to pick it up and uh, full disclosure, it cost me $16. So. Uh, I didn't want to get into the whole pricing thing because I haven't been able to find them online outside of this one that I bought. And so maybe it's sold out, maybe, I, I don't know, maybe more coming in the pipeline, but uh, I was happy to grab this one, even if it was at a slightly in inflated price. The differences between the standard Sarasa seem to be fairly limited. The grip is the same, logos are the same, inset plastic. I'm curious now what happened with this clip. I've always found the clip on this pen to be extremely strange looking. It's just, it's just too high. There's no reason to make it this high except for maybe to have a little bit of leverage here so you could really expand it. But that seems to have been fixed on this pen. It's much lower key. And here it just, it looks great. Like it's probably how this one should look. So I'm, I'm wondering now if this first Sarasa Grand I had is a lemon, or if uh, the design was changed. It's a little bit hard to tell. I've been looking for some pictures online to see if there was a change, but it looks like they totally nailed it with this one. Uh, I may have to try to mod my original to match this profile, because it's much, much better. Uh, this one does have the sticker, which is uh, common with pens that are sent over from Japan. Uh, this one I bought uh, it does not, and I thought it was a Japanese import, but I could be wrong. So that is pretty much it. That's the Sarasa Grand in uh, what the company I bought it from calls Royal Silver. The uh, I'll put the model number they posted in the comments below, in the show notes below, whatever. Opening the pen up, you can see very smooth action. And then in this one, I have, uh, I put the Zebra, I put a 1.0 millimeter in here. I tend to prefer that 1.0. This one, also quite smooth. I believe this piece is plastic. I'm almost positive it's plastic, in fact. And again, this is brand new. It just showed up very recently. And this ships with that Zebra in a 0.5 millimeter. The Sarasas come in a, in a really nice 0.4 millimeter, or again, that 1.0 millimeter is quite nice. And then I believe you could fit some different uh, different refills in here if that is uh, something you're willing to do. K 
can't quite recall what will fit and will not fit. This is an Energel refill. Typically a larger refill, but So the Energels stick out a little bit more than you'd want, maybe a millimeter or two, but click is perfect. So that means this pen is a great staging ground for other refills if you so desire. I, I tend to actually really like the Sarasas, as I've noted multiple times. So I'll leave it at that. No real need to get into a writing test. I've done a lot of writing with the different Sarasas and I'm gonna do a more comprehensive video on them briefly since there are a lot of mild, uh, models out now. So yeah, just a quick peek at this Sarasa Grand Royal Silver. Um, I'll be keeping an eye out for more of these since I'm quite pleased by it. So thanks for watching.